Hello, I'm Richard Hooper and this is Sat TV Week. Now I'm here at IBC with Hamid and Mark from Skyway Global. Now tell me a little bit more about the products you're showcasing at IBC. Our focus for this year has been KA band, both uh, fixed and motorized antennas. And we have basically to my left, uh, 1.2 meter KA band motorized antenna that we have for the first time we are showing it at IBC show. And beyond that, our focus is gonna be at 1.8 meter, as well as 2.4 meter KA band motorized antenna. Then at the same time, we are also working on the 98, 1.2, and 1.8, and 2.4 meter KA band antenna for fixed VSAT market. Now, what particular market sectors are you targeting for your products? As Hamid said, the KA band is really a hot market, a lot of growth in KA band with the additional uh, HDS uh, high, high throughput satellites are being launched. And so KA around the world in a variety of applications is, is particularly hot. Um, also, any of the markets where the middle class is growing or the income levels of the middle class are growing uh, is increasing the demand for consumer broadband. And we've shipped uh, probably more broadband antennas uh, than anybody in the world uh, on a numbers basis. So uh, consumer broadband is an important market for us as well uh, as the KA uh, VSAT that, that Hamid talked about. Now, how important is uh, research and development in, in your products and keeping you competitive? We certainly have a lot of cl close collaboration with our customers, customer base, and also with the service provider in, in the industry. As well, uh, uh, for example, like Udalsat, FCC, we certainly are in direct contact with them to get the information we need and make sure we have the right product for the market. Not to highlight too that uh, we even do a lot of development work on materials. We're showcasing a lightweight uh, SMC product uh, that takes 40% of the weight out of our antenna. And uh, so a lot of that's collaboration with our materials vendors uh, as well as our customers. So how important is quality in this market over price? Uh, go ahead. Yeah, I'd, I'd say that the quality is preeminent, uh, the, particularly as we move up in, in the band, uh, the KA band, for example, the higher frequency bands uh, require very uh, fine uh, surface precision. And uh, so that, that, that is something we have a very long history in providing. And, uh, and we, we've proven that we can provide very high quality products. We're vertically integrated, both in metal products. We stamp our own metal products, and we also uh, compression mold all of our uh, SMC products. So uh, quality is preeminent in these higher frequency products. And so uh, our history, our legacy uh, of having developed products over a very long period of time helps give us a very strong quality foundation. Now, have there been any significant changes in the type of materials that you're now looking to use in your products? I mean, as Mark mentioned a few minutes ago, our focus has been to come up with a lighter SMC material that we can integrate that with our newer motorized antennas to basically make it much easier in terms of installation and shipment. So that is our, our focus today for the material. And it's a significant uh, improvement uh, over the traditional SMC uh, but also allows us to compete with carbon at a fraction of the cost. So looking forward 12 to 24 months, what sort of trends are we going to see in the marketplace? Uh, really what we are doing, ma making sure our product portfolio is complete at KA band, that is our focus. And also try to make sure we, f we fill any gap in our legacy product line, for example, like KU band and C band, if there is any specific pro uh, uh, project or program somewhere on network, we want to make sure we are ready for those type of opportunities in the market. Yeah, and I'd highlight too that just the number of, of satellites, high throughput satellites, uh, are expected to almost double over the next 36 months. And so there's a lot of macroeconomic growth trends uh, in high throughput satellites that require precision antennas and terminals to be able to communicate with those satellites. And so we're excited about the future. Thank you very much. Thank you.